Hey YouTube. Sorry about the lack of videos lately. Um, I've been out and about this summer with family coming over, going to see family, stuff like that. So, yep, sorry about the lack of videos. But anyway, today I'm going to be showing you guys the next part of my collection, which is the Wii U collection. Um, here's my Wii U here. It's the 32 gig deluxe version. And in terms of accessories I have for it, I really don't have much. Um, well, I've got the gamepad, of course, which is right here. But um, other than that, I don't really have anything unless you count the Wii accessories, which I showed in the last video. Um, because I actually use this as my main Wii now. Um, I just keep the Wii for collection's sake. Um, that way it upscales my Wii games to HD with the HDMI and, you know, just to simplify things a little bit, I guess. So, yep, I use that as my main Wii now, but anyway, let's move on to the games, which I keep in this case here as tradition. Um, so we'll start out with New Super Mario Bros. U, which is a really fun game. It was, of course, a launch title. Uh, next we got New Super Luigi U, which I decided to get the, the box version versus the download version because I prefer to get boxed for physical copies of things if possible because, it, I don't know, I just feel better having the physical copy. Um, next we got Pikmin 3, which is a really great game. The graphics are amazing on it. Um, next we got Mario Kart 8, which I've already beaten everything in single player, but I still play online a whole bunch. So if you want to add me on there and race me, my username, my Nintendo Network ID is com the same as my com same as my YouTube username, ComputerKid1416. So feel free to friend me on there and I'll add you back. Um, next we got Zelda the One Waker HD. I was a huge fan of the original game back in the day, so I decided to get that. Um, and the enhancements they had to it make it a lot better than the original, in my opinion. So, I highly recommend it. But next we got Wii Party U, which is a pretty fun party game, very similar to Mario Party. I mean, until the Mario Party does come out for the Wii U, this is the only party game so far. So, yep, it's pretty fun. And then we got Nintendo Land, which of course was the packing game. I'm kind of like Wii Sports in that it kind of helps you show off, or kind of shows off the Wii use capabilities with the gamepad and whatnot. Um, next we got Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Um, very good game, actually. I'm a, hu I'm a huge fan of the Donkey Kong Country games, and I think Retro Studios has done a good job with them. So, um, And then, I think this is it. Yep, last we got Super Mario 3D World. Which, say what you want about it, but I think it's a really great game. Um, it may not be a true 3D Mario game like Galaxy or Sunshine, but it's a really, really fun game. Um, it's basically the sequel to Super Mario, Super Mario 3D Land on the 3DS. Yep, so that's it for the games, guys. And um, in the next part, I'll be starting the handheld series. Actually, no, I won't. Um, I've gotten a console since I've started this series that I didn't get to do at the time because I didn't have it, but that I've got to go back and do, which is the Atari 2600. Um, I actually own one now, so. But the next part of the collection series will be that, and then I will move on to the handhelds. So, yep, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Bye.